Hello, boys and girls. This is our new topic, prime numbers. You have not yet learned this title before. How do we recognize or identify a prime number? Let's look at these two rules. The first one must be greater than one. Greater means more than. Lebih daripada satu. Now, I want to ask you, is number one a prime number? No, right? Because it is not greater than one. Nombor satu tak lebih daripada satu. Jadi, nombor satu not prime number. Bukan nombor prime number. Okay. Second rule, it can only be divided by one and itself. Nombor itu hanya boleh dibahagi dengan satu dan diri sendiri. What does it mean? Now, look at this one. Number two. Okay, look at number two. Can two divide by one? Can, right? Okay. 2 divide 1, 2 divide by 1, 1, 2, 2. No remainder, without remainder. So, the answer is 2. Tak ada baki kan? Okay, so can divide by 1. Divide by itself means that 2 divide by itself. Itself means 2. Dirinya sendiri. So, 2 divide 2, what we get? Is 1, right? 2 divided 2, we get 1. So, 2 can divide by 1 and itself. Can 2 divide by 3? Can 2 divide by 3? Don't know. Okay. If you don't know, then we check. 2 divide by 3. 3, we have to choose 0. 0. Because 3, 1 already 3. We cannot choose 3. We have to choose 0. So, we will get a remainder of 2. Right? Means that means that 2 only can be divided by 1 and itself. So, this is a prime number. Let's look at number 3. Okay, 3 can divide by itself. 3 divide by, okay, sorry. 3 divide by 1 first. 3 divide by 1, we get 3. Okay, and itself, dirinya sendiri. 3 divide 3, we get 1. Can 3 divide by others number? Bahagi dengan nombor lain. For example, divide by 2 divide by 4 okay let's check this one 2 3 divide by 2 2 1 2 remainder 1 so cannot 3 cannot divide by others number except except 1 and itself so number 3 also a prime number next 4 4 can divide by 1, we get 4. 4 can divide by 4 itself, we get 1. But 4 also can divide by 2. Okay, let's see. 4 divide 2, 2, 2, 4. No remainder, no remainder. Means that we can write 2 here, means that 4 can divide by 1, 2, and 4. So, so, now I have to cross this. This is not a prime number because can divide by 2. Now, number 5. Number 5. We check first. 5 can divide by 1. 
5. 5 can divide by 5, we get 1. Right. Now, can 5 divide by 2 or 5 can divide by 3, 5 divide by 4? Can or not? You will get a remainder, right? When you divide, you will get remainder. You will get a remainder here, right? So, means that 5 is a prime number. 6. For number 6, 6 can divide by 1. 6 can divide by itself. Okay. However, 6 also can divide by 2. 6 divide 2, we get 3. Right? And then 6 also can divide by 3. We will get 2, right? Because of this 2, because of this 2, so 6 is not a prime number. Okay, disebabkan nombor 6 boleh bahagi dengan nombor lain. Selain satu dengan diri sendiri, jadi dia bukan nombor perdana. Understand? Now, we want to identify the prime number from number 1 until 100. Okay. Takkan kita nak buat macam tadi satu-satu kan? It's take time, right? So, I have some tips for you here. How to identify the prime numbers from 1 until 100. Okay. First. I make a hundred table, okay? Jadual, nombor satu hingga seratus. Okay? Now, tips number one. Cross number one, pangkah nombor satu. Why? Because the first rule say that a prime number must be greater than one. So now, I have to cross number one. Bukan nombor perdana. So, I have to cross it. Okay. Done, this one. Number two. Cross the number which can divided by two. Okay. Nombor yang boleh bahagi dengan dua tanpa baki. Except two. Kecuali dua. Pangka nombor yang boleh bahagi dengan dua... Kecuali dua. So, we cannot cross this two. Nombor dua, jangan pangka. Okay, sekarang, ingat tak si Fay? Do you still remember times table of two? One, two, 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 four, three, two, six, right? So, two we cannot cross. We cross four. After four, six, eight, ten, right? After ten, twelve. 14, 16, 18, 20. Okay. And then 22, 24. Alright. We memorize until 1, 12, uh, sorry, 2, 12, 24. Right? So, how to continue? We just add 2. 24 add 2 plus 2, you get 26, right? So, you cross. 26 plus 2, 28. You cross until 100. Okay? Cross it until 100. 50, 52, 54, 58, 60. Then 72, 74, 76, 78, 80. 82, 84, 86, 88, 90. And the last rule. Okay. Now, we already done the second tips. Now, let's go to the third tips. Cross the numbers which can be divided by 3. Except 3. Pangkah nombor yang boleh bahagi dengan tiga, kecuali tiga. So, three jangan pangkah. Okay. Sifat tiga pula. Time tables of three. One, three, three. 
two, three, six, right? Okay, six sudah. Six. After that, nine. After nine, twelve. And then fifteen. After that, eighteen. Twenty-one. Twenty-four. Twenty-seven. Thirty. Thirty-three. And thirty-six. Sampai thirty-six, dah habiskan si Fei awak. One times, uh, three times twelve, thirty-six, right? Now you add three. Bertambah tiga-tiga. Okay? Thirty-six plus three is thirty-nine. And then plus three. Forty-two. Plus three. Forty-five. Plus three. Forty-eight. Plus three. Fifty-one. Plus three. Fifty-four. Plus three, fifty-seven. Plus three, sixty. Sixty plus three, sixty-three. Sixty-three plus three, sixty-six. And then plus three, sixty-nine. Plus three, seventy-two. Plus three, seventy-five. Plus three, seventy-eight. Plus three, eighty-one. Plus three, eighty-four. Plus three, eighty-seven. Plus three, ninety. Ninety plus three, ninety-three. Ninety-three plus three, ninety-six. Ninety-six plus three, ninety-nine. Okay, done for the third digits. Now, the fourth one, cross the numbers which can divided by five, except five. Yang boleh bahagi dengan lima kecuali lima. So five cannot cross. After five is ten, right? After that fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, sixty, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five, ninety, ninety-five. And one hundred. Okay, number four done. Now the fifth tip: cross the numbers which can be divided by seven, except seven, kecuali tujuh. Sekarang si Fe tujuh pula ya. Okay, this one cannot cross except seven. So after seven is fourteen. This is fourteen. Okay, after fourteen. Twenty one, right? After twenty one, twenty eight. After twenty eight, thirty five. After thirty five, forty two. After forty two, forty nine. After forty nine, fifty six. After fifty six. Sixty three, okay. After sixty three, seventy. After seventy, seventy seven. After seventy seven is eighty four. All right. Then you have to add seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven is ninety one. Cross ninety one, and then you. At seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, ninety-eight done. That's all. So the number which I did I didn't cross means a primes number. Nombor yang saya tak pangka adalah nombor perdana adalah prime number yang saya pangka bukan. Okay. I hope that you can understand how to find the prime numbers from number one to one hundred. After that, continue to do your exercise. Take out your exercise book. Okay, as usual, you have to draw a margin at the left side, the this line, and then write the day and date. Write the title, prime numbers, and then I want you to do a circle map. All right, please find a things that circle shape. 
then you draw the circle don't don't free hand don't draw free hand okay so at the middle here you write prime numbers so what should you write outside here i want you to list out the prime numbers from one until one hundred okay just now i already show how to find the prime number so now you have to list out number two three after that five uh, sorry this five and so on uh, until 97.